Careful, careful. careful. Don't go too fast down this hillside. I've done that mistake before. Nearly killed myself. Up, up, up. Bit of a scramble down here. You bought it on Steam for five. That was a good price. It's nice picking up games in the sale. I always think you enjoy a game more if you haven't had to pay a lot for it. Um, it just, I don't know. Whenever I pay like full price for a game, like I did for something like Far Cry 5, which I did enjoy, I always feel a, a little bit aggrieved or a little bit worried that, you know, I think I've got to get my money's worth and time out of this. Money isn't that easy to come by and it's all too easy to get rid of quickly. Am I in an impenetrable sodding jungle here? Come on, pebbles. Just eat your way through it. What about if I jump? Oh, that worked. I'm up a tree. Horse up a tree. Whatever next. You're not going to touch um, No Man's Sky Seahorn. Well, I don't blame you. It was massively overhyped. And not just overhyped, the developers just lied about it straight out right. It claiming it had features or claiming it would have features at launch that it just didn't. It was just nowhere near um, what they claimed it to be. So there's a lot of people who paid full price for it will feel very aggrieved at it. But I can't believe it was two years ago, because I remember the hype about it, and I remember the disappointment people felt in it, as if it was just six months ago. But apparently it was two years. Yeah. But instead of just taking the money and running, the developers have actually sat down and patched it, majorly patched it, and put all or a lot of the features they talked about in it. And they've not tried to sell it as DLC, they've actually, for free, put the features in, which is what they should have done. They should have had it like that at the start, or sold it for half the price, or something. <clears throat> but they just shouldn't have hyped it so much. It just wasn't a game that was ready to, to be sold, I think, when it came out. So good on them for actually standing by it and doing it. There's a lot that wouldn't. But uh, yeah, you're right. They, they made a right mess of it when it, um, when it came out. It was a scandal. Right. No, you're not the right guy. I am at the right place here, aren't I? I'm not eating from the pot. I've eaten enough recently. Mill made Anna. Hang on. Where's the miller? Oh. Very hard lock. I can't do those. Let me just check my skills, actually. Have anything, has anything gone up that I need to spend points in? Vitality must, surely. Marathon man, sprinter. Human dustbin, that is me. Blood rush and berserk. Now these look good. As soon as your health starts to fall, you're, you go berserk and your stamina regenerates four times faster. Don't know about that. After beating your first opponent, the power of your attacks will increase for a while and your stamina will regenerate faster. I'm having that one. That sounds awesome. Really handy when you're outnumbered, and I need to get to level 12. You'll survive an otherwise fatal blow, and your health will even regenerate by 20%. And the Revenant, your health will regenerate gradually, does not apply during combat. I think I should probably keep the perk points for that, you know. I've got two, though. I'll get another one at level 12. Human Dustbin. Sounds like me. Sprinter, you uh, you run faster, but also tire faster. Sprinting is 20% faster because 20% more stamina. The Marathon Man is 20% slower, but demands less stamina. Which one, chat? Which one do you reckon? Hang on, Ims. I'll just give you permission. In, uh, you can you can link the um, thing in chat. Should probably have done this earlier but uh sorry i got caught up with things there you go if you're still there just just drop a drop a link in chat to the videos or cathol's youtube people can find it from there um i don't want to go berserk sprinter or marathon you see if i go marathon i'll not be able to run away from people fast enough if I go sprinter i can catch them up but run out of stamina faster hmm think about that one for a minute That's, that was Vitality. The next one's coming up a really good. Sorry. Yeah, that was stamina. I've got an, I've got an agility one. Don't really like these ones, so I'm going to go with Fast Striker because on agility weapons, I can strike faster. Take that one. 
Hey, Keith Ave. Good afternoon from Canada. Well, good evening from North Yorkshire. <laughs> what part of Canada are you from? I've got two combos to pick in with the sword. Nothing with the mace just yet. That, that levels up and get perks slowly. And the bow is slow as well. Sprinter's good for chasing down boar and roe deer to fell them with your sword. That's a good idea. That is a good idea. Oh, sorry, Ims. Has it come on? Oh, hang on. <laughs> uh, let's have a look. There you go. Try it now. And skills. Oh, I've got a drinking perk. A drinking habit. What does that do? Under the influence of alcohol, your hand will shake less and your bow skill is higher. But when sober, your hand will shake more. I'm not doing that. I have to be a proper alky to do that. Manitoba. Uh, Keith, is, uh, I haven't been to Manitoba. Although, my family was interested in moving there, take up farming. I come from a farming background. And we were considering that at one point. I went to, I went to, I've been to British Columbia, that's the only place I've been in Canada. Nice, nice country though. Uh, let's see, I'm going to pick one of these. I get damage and bonus mounted combat with range and melee weapons for being a knight or war horse. And my horse won't shy at nearby foes, as at least no one hits him. What's the dread steed? If your horse is wounded, it will run faster. Well, I don't know if I'm going to do much mounted combat. Hmm, I'll pick the war horse one. And lock picking, I'm pretty sure. Deft grip. No, don't need that. Repair man. No, don't need that. I'm looking, I'm waiting for the good ones in there. I'm saving my perk points. Right, anyway. Uh, where's this damn miller gone? Yeah, Manitoba. Uh, uh, we were told it was flat. It was good, uh, good crop growing country. But yeah, British Columbia was beautiful, and is beautiful, but it was um, 11 years, at least 11 years since I was there, but it, it was it was good, I like Canada, nice place, if I was going to move out of, the, out of the UK, Canada would be one of the two places I think I'd consider, the other being New Zealand, because that was awesome as well, well hello, ah, didn't know I could go in there, right, there's supposed to be a damn miller here, Why can't I see him? He's just a he's just a villager, right? God be with you. He's not the guy I need. I'm looking for a fellow called Riki. Do you know him? Riki? You mean Hinek, the courier's son? Maybe. Do you know where I might find him? He's not usually around here. Try asking at his home, but I hope you've got a thick skin. The old courier ain't exactly charming. Hmm. Okay, I didn't know I was looking for a Riki, but that's, uh... So you know this Hinek? Oh, can new perk point for the main him? level. Um, Not much, I confess. Most of the village folk avoid him like the plague. Why is that? No one with a nose likes spending too much time around Tanners. And that Riki keeps bad company. I've never heard a good word said about him. Uh, yeah, Big Duck, there there might be some speech perks available. I'll have a look. What can you tell I haven't about looked the at them for a while. He's as cantankerous as a hog in a thorn bush. He won't talk to anyone. Cobley, you reckon the miller's sleeping by the cookpot? Did I did I walk past him and miss it? Cheers, I'll go and have a look. Oh, we know why they call him why Reeky. Why do they call Hinek Reeky, anyway? He's a tanner, isn't he? If you're ever downwind of him, you'll understand. Tanning isn't a trade for the weak of stomach. True enough, but not every courier gets cursed with a name like that. Well, the Hinek's nature is no sweeter than his hmm. smell. They used to use dog shit and stuff for tanning leather, I think, which would be pretty grim. Why has he got such a bad name? Hmm. Well, like his old man, he doesn't talk much to anyone. And then he's always skulking off somewhere. I heard he got a taste of the pillory in Ratai for thieving. And in Neuhof, he got boozed up in the alehouse with his cronies, and they beat up some merchants. So it wasn't more that than me? High spirits. Just so. We're all honest folk here, and we've no use for the likes of him. Okay. 
Don't tell me there's not a single person who talks to him. He's been seen around with one of the bathhouse wenches. Adela, ah. I believe she's called. A reason to visit the bathhouse. And it's all in the name of a quest. Okay, I had no idea I was looking for Riki. That's obviously some side quest I've picked up. So this Miller is asleep by the cooking pot. So he is. Wake up. I am honoured that you should come to me. Um, oh, right, I might have some, I might have a job for you there. I've done as you asked. Excellent and over the Henry. stolen goods. I look forward to the latest news from Talmberg. I hope Captain Robot rubs the commander's nose right in it. I might have just shit on my own doorstep with that. I'll have to wait and see if anything bad comes of doing that. Um, oh, let's go then. Let's get the carpenters done. Is there done. any work here for carpenters? I'm not looking for anyone at the moment. Well, well, worth asking. Have you got any more jobs for me? Of course. You're just in time. I could do with a horse. And since I'm setting the task, I'll go further. I'd like a strong stallion direct from the Merhoyed stables. Now, that's no mean feat, mm. asking. As well I know. And well I'll pay. I don't even know where that town is. I'll steal that horse for you. But the rewards had better be worth it. Don't worry. But you'd best not come back with some old nag. See you later. That is likely to get me into trouble. I might have to knock out some stable boys or something. <laughs> so I don't get seen. That one's likely to cause me trouble. But, you know, it's a stealing quest. I quite like them. Training. Uh, I think they're teaching um, pickpocketing or lockpicking. So, what time of day is it now? It's early enough. I head down this road to the bats. Is that right? We're going to the bats. Via this miller. In case there's anything I have to do when I'm there. Can't remember. <clears throat> yeah. Then we get a quick bath and we go into town and we sell all that looted stuff. And then I start working over some of the quests down here. I've got another load of bandits to kill. Got some, um, what have I got to do? Got to do, got to go and catch some nightingales in the woods. The opposite ends of the questing spectrum there. Kill bandits, catch birds in the woods. All in a day's work. I'm going to find some herbs somewhere as well, but uh, I don't think I'll look around here. Probably just buy some actually from a herb seller. Maybe he has wicked skills. Who knows? Who knows? Maybe I should have asked him. I'm, well, I'm going to be back there with the stolen horse at some point in the future. So I'll ask then. I wonder how much I'm going to haggle the price of that horse down by in, uh, in Neuhof. Right, so I've got to, I've got to remember that it's... Because I'm not going looking at the horses again. It's Al Baruch or... Bucephalus. They're both, uh, they're both fine, acceptable choices. Um, hello, Mr. Miller. Oh, stop, stop. You got anything for I us? I hope I can be of help to you, Knight. It's me, Henry. Is there any work here for carpenters? In this day and age, I'm glad I can support myself. Okay. Can no new gossip. Me. No, I think I've got all that. I think I've got all that. That's all. Oh god, are we onto the dad jokes already? It's early in the night for them, isn't it? It's nine o'clock already. Crikey. Right, I'm just gonna go and find my chest of stolen artifacts. Need to come and see her in the evening later. So what am I selling? A lot of this stuff actually. Well let's have a look at what's still stolen. And the bludgeon. I might as well take that as well. Massively over encumbered. Okay, weapons. There's a villager's U bow, which is marked as nicked. 
And some Milanese Carras is marked as nicked. So I'll put them back in the chest. Nothing else is, thankfully. Anything, anything? No, cool. I've got some... I've got some very nice stuff to go and sell there. Those dad jokes. Right. Put that down. Stolen weapons. I'm going to put the bow in because I'm not going to get found with nicked... Nicked weapons on us. So I wander into town. And that. I'm waiting for that. That's going to be an awesome piece of armor when it finally becomes available to use. Was there anything else? No. That's it. Right. More importantly, do I need to use any of this stuff? Uh, cumin. Oh, God, there's so much. Where does that go? It just goes over there. Oh, that's rubbish. These things... My my head's my head my helmet's got fifteen. I don't like the look of those anyway, so I'll sell them. The van braces, they go on the arm. My current van braces. Hang on, if I do that, I should be able to see pretty quickly. Got one of those on, so that's all right. And these halberts are actually quite good. They're thirteen. Where's mine? My short one's only 12. 21 versus these. They're lighter. Hang on a minute. Stab defense 10, 13, 8. 9, 12, 7. Right, okay. I'm having one of those on. I'll just need to get it fixed. That's good. And I can sell the other thing. My old plate pauldrons. Where do they go? They go there, but I've got better ones. Okay. Cuban van braces, composite gut. Where? Where? I have. I am sure I have some normal van braces. Do I not? So what am I wearing then? The hell's that? Riveted van braces, right? And they're better. Okay, cool. That's good. Uh, Page's Sword, Hungarian Sabre, isn't bad. It's not better than that, though. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Right. Oh, well, we've got an armor upgrade out of that, which is quite nice. She just woke it up. No. Right, then. Let's have a quick wash. Go with the bats. How's my stuff looking? Um, it's not as dirty as I thought. I thought all my stuff was filthy. Maybe I just washed it in a trough and it, it worked. Okay. I still need to go to the bath so to talk to that woman. Yeah. Right. To the bathhouse. Oh, you know what? While I'm here, while I'm here, I might as well get a get a wash and a shave and all the stuff. Time is eight, so the merchants might not even be open yet, anyway. God, this is so slow. I gotta sell this crap. Hello, which nobles packed is awesome here? I bet that's hands. Right then, Mrs. I'm interested in your uh, services. Let's talk trade. What does and she what sell? Is it you'd like? We'll just go for a bath, I think. Proper bath. And my clothes need washing. As you wish. Do you have the coin? We do need have the coin. Let's just pay. Fine. Ten groschen. Here it is. I'm sure you'll be extremely satisfied. Right then. Where's this last gone? Ah, 
Not in here. Is this even the right bathhouse to talk to this woman? Let's just check. Not showing up on there. Could be another one. God, I've got a load of quests up there. Oh, it's saying track down Riki up there, so I'm guessing. Ah, uh, there's a bathhouse wench. Right, okay, we don't need to do that. Wrong place. Whew. Right, I'd be glad to get rid of all this armour. I wonder if I've got a load on the horse as well that needs selling. Let's go get it done. Yeah. And, ouch. Yeah. My horsemanship skills are lacking. So what are you guys up to this week? Anything exciting? Anything special planned? Any games you're playing? Any new games coming out that you hope to get? Unbreak turn around there. And this is where we get off. And we go and sharpen up our swords. Right, what did I have on the horse? Because the horse was overloaded as well. Uh, nothing I need there. Spare ash bow if I can find someone to sell it to. Hang on, where did I get a cuirass from? I don't remember that. But yeah, all that stuff's going to need selling, isn't it? That's a lot of stuff. Um, can I carry all that? Well, let's try. Hunter's gloves. And nobleman's boots for a grand. Oh, oh I can just about scrape myself over. Holiday for you, big duck. That sounds pretty good. Go with this common saber. Case trying to play more than three rounds of World of Tanks without rage quitting. Good luck with that. Okay. Let's get that on. Right then. Cool. Let's get that sharpened up a bit. It really annoys me how Henry can run through the woods in all his armour and stuff and weapons, yet he gets out of breath so easily peddling this stone. I guess it probably is quite heavy and hard work. No, I feel like we can clean that bit up a bit more. Just there. That tip of the blade is looking better. Okay, that'll do. I think your recent record is five games. Oh, well, good luck with it. Yeah, cool. Hungarian Sabre. Let's get that done as well. Get a nice little edge on this. I like the way it cleans up the edge. You can see it improving. Getting all that smear and blur off. I wonder how I can clean my mace or whether I have to get that repaired. That looks good anyway. That looks very good, in fact. Yay! New... Point in maintenance. 96, that'll do, because I'm only going to sell it. Seahorn's harassing jingles for quitting I Am Commander. Yeah, I heard he was having trouble with that, with uh, one problem or another. He was blaming um, the school holidays for all the kids being at home and downloading stuff. Well, kids are at home watching his videos and playing World of Tanks and the other games he promotes. <laughs> his real problem is Virgin Media. They are just... They're just terrible for overselling their capacity. I've had a few clients and friends even who've been on them and every now and again their speed just drops down to next to nothing and it's because they've got too many people on the same connections and they just don't have the capacity for the amount of customers they're bringing in all the time. It's crazy. Absolutely crazy. Can't do that, can I? Nope. Can't repair anything with that. Blacksmith kit. Oh, I can repair my shield. And that, and I, I use a blacksmith's kit to repair a bow, but whatever. We'll do it. And I don't think I need to do anything with the armourer's kit. And the cobbler's kit. Oh, I can't, actually. The 
The silent shoes. Have I got them on my... I shouldn't have them. I shouldn't have them on my um, person. Where are they? The silent shoes are for stealing stuff. And they're only supposed to be... Yeah, they're supposed to be kept on the horse. Where I can't sell them by accident. Hmm. In the face of trouble and fear, Jingle showed his mighty rear. That's a... Stop! I need to search... Oh, go ahead. Get go, go ahead. Why? The Orders of his lordship. I've got nothing stolen on me. I was very sensible and put it back. So look at that guard. I need, I need, I need to beat 15 speechcraft. I can't beat any of these, so... I could try that one, but I suspect it's going to be 15 as well. Go for it. If you insist. I'm innocent. That didn't hurt a bit. Now did it. Carry on. I don't like his tone of voice. It's far too aggressive. I don't know. Random stop and search. Um, oh, this is a weaponsmith. Let's go and sell some stuff. There's a quest giver around here somewhere as well. Up, up, up. Come here, come here, come here. I need to unload. <laughs> I need to unload them. Got some heavy packs. Uh, oh. I've heard that some pilgrim was selling off pieces of a rare sword. If you happen to have one, I'd be interested. Did that Sasso dabbler send you here? Why? Why? Because there was nothing left for him. And now he's envious and wants some too. Well, he's out of luck. I do have it, but I'm not selling. Man, isn't right. there some way? No way. Like I've already said, not a chance. We're going to steal that then, but not tonight. Oh, repairs? Oh my God. This is going to cost a fortune to repair. Some stuff I don't want. I want to repair that. Craftsman can't repair such a badly damaged... This craftsman can't. Okay. Maybe there's a better one then. Nothing else. You can repair the cuirass though, can't you? No, this guy's crap. I need a blacksmith. I'm going to sell... Anyway, I'm just going to sell the crap off, so... Let's go and do that. Sell, sell, sell. This guy's got some nice stuff, actually. So we sell... What's he got? 2k wealth. Sell the bludgeon. The common saber. That knackered one, that knackered one, not my sword. Is that it? Is that all I can sell here? Hmm, okay. I get 77 grosh, and this is awful. Oh, I'm looking at the stats on there. I thought something had just gone badly wrong. Right then, yeah, we're going to haggle. See, the armor smith. I'd like to discuss the sell the stuff too. Well, we can try it. Too right, we're going to try it. We're gonna haggle. We're gonna get some more money than that. Are we agreed? That's still too much. Yeah, I thought it would be. Let's try that. What do you say to this? The final offer. A nice sum. Just lord. Where's he gonna come to? And there you see, I've made quite a nice little extra bit out of that. Aye, for that amount, I got him. Be persuaded. Well, that was barely worth it. Right then. See if I can waddle next door to the. Uh, what's he called? The tailor. 